So this video is going to show you how to take a screenshot on your school laptop. And if you don't have a school laptop, you can always Google how do I take a screenshot or a print screen of, you know, using whatever computer you're using. So number one, um, down here on the little search bar, you just can type in snip. And it's going to come up with a snipping tool. There's also this snip and sketch, which you can use, right? So snipping tool has moved. So try snip and sketch. And it's going to bring this up, right? So uh, if you want a new snip, you just hit new. And then um, you're just going to click and drag wherever you want to take the screenshot. Okay. So um, let's say I ask you, I don't want to, um, I don't want to save this one, but um, let's say I ask you if, you know, to take a, a snippet of your grades. So you can either, you can do that one of two ways. Um, if you log in to the class homepage, try to get this in there, uh, and you go to your classes, all of your classes will pull up, and it's going to show you your overall grade. So you can either um, come to this page and do a snippet, so new snippet, right? And then you're just going to click and drag over whatever class that you have with me, or you can do all the classes, and release. And then you hit this little save as, so a little disk, little floppy disk. Most of you probably don't even know what a floppy disk is, but um, that's the save button. And then you can rename it, and then it's going to tell you where you're saving it, right? So are you saving it to your desktop? Are you saving it to downloads? Are you saving it to documents? So you figure out where you want to save it. Um, for me, it's just easier to quickly find on the desktop. And I would just say grades 3-4 or whatever, right? And then save it. not valid. So I'll say grades, March 4th, save. So that will show up on my desktop. Then if I was wanting to add it to a Blackboard slide, I would simply just go and find it. Like, let's say this is the image. I would just find it and then drag and let go, right? So I would just let it go on the Blackboard. And that's how you take a snippet tool. Or you can go back to, um, actually your homepage and then go to your grades tab and that's going to show you not only your overall grade but each individual grade so maybe you're missing um, an assignment or you scored low on a quiz or a test right so again um, you can just go back up to the snip and sketch hit the new click and drag let it go and then save it and again make sure that you know where it's saving Right, so desktop, downloads, documents, pictures, wherever you're saving it, make sure you know where that is. Okay, so you can see the first one is saved on my desktop as well. So I can save that, and then I can get out of all of these things. Maybe. Okay, so it won't let me get out of the Solution Center, but... Maybe. Anyways, so it won't let me get out of that one. There we go. Um, but here's my grades for March 4th, right? My individual grades. And here are hmm. and here are my grades for the other March 4th, right? So these are my overall grades, and then these are my individual grades. And again, to drag those onto Blackboard, you would just click and hold and drag it over the Blackboard and hover and then let go. 